This is Chris with Hard Money Bankers. We're here in uh, Reisterstown, Maryland, northwest of Baltimore City, uh, taking a look at a property that a client of ours, somewhat new client, but he's done a couple deals with us now. They seem to do good work on uh, rehab jobs. Um, he's under contract or about to be under contract with this property. Um, Jason's inside taking a look at it now. We're just doing our preliminary inspection. We haven't done appraisal or anything like that yet, but we're just just getting into it. And uh, here's Jason right here taking a look. Jason, you want to let us know what's going on here with this property? Sure. Hey, this is Jason at Hard Money Bankers. We are in Reisterstown, Maryland. Come inside, let's take a look, see what we can find out about this house. This is a very large property, and it's actually uh, has had several additions over the last few years. I think the previous borrowers leveraged themselves pretty good on these things, and the property got foreclosed on by the bank. And honestly, they just let the property go. Uh, there's some water damage. A lot of the floors are buckled. So there's there's a decent amount of work that needs to be completed in this property. This is a full kitchen right here. There's a decent amount of work that needs to be completed, but it's you know very manageable and. You know, there could be a very decent size of profit at the end of the day. So, you know, some of the property is in very, very good condition still, um, while others is, um, you know, obviously let go. So this is kind of an, an odd room, but it's, you know, it's supposed to be a, a dining area or a, kind of an eating kitchen. And if you want to come over here, this is uh, one of the kitchens. Nice, nice color pink they got going on in here. Well, Inter this is interesting to be a addition. Master bedroom suite. I did talk to the borrowers, and I think they're going to turn this into a living area or a game room, just because it's you know additional space. And if you actually look out the windows, this is what all the other properties look like. And these properties over here typically will sell for two hundred to two hundred twenty-five thousand. Um, our loan on this is actually going to be about 130, and then we're going to be holding back the construction costs. Um, so at the end of the day, we're going to be into this thing all in at about 60 to 65 percent of what one of these, which is a normal size house for this neighborhood, looks like. Um, and as you can see, this property is you know, obviously significantly bigger and you know significantly more desirable because of extra space than the, the two car garage. Take a quick look at the two-car garage here. Two-car garage. And let's go into some other areas of the house. I know there's some, I know there's mold in the basement, and water damage, and this is all water damage with the buckle right here. Here is a full bath. Here's one bedroom. That's a second bedroom. And this is another bedroom, and this is again another addition that was added. This is like a whole other level down here. There's definitely a lot of mold down here. There's a ton of water damage. It looks like this was the kitchen up here. And this is where all the water came from. So I know the borrowers right now are getting a quote on uh, mold removal. And that's going to be a big chunk of their budget. Mm -hmm. And But this is a big open living area. 
So we're still in the process of underwriting this thing. Um, I do know where our ARV is at. I do know that I want to base it off of the medium you know, style property in this neighborhood, which is the two to 225. I do know I want to be in this loan about 130. We just got to figure out how much construction really is necessary in here, which is probably going to be, I don't know, maybe 40 to $50,000. Um, I know their original budget was 30 to 35, but I think the mold removal is kicking that up even higher. So there's a few more things we need to work out in this, you know, in the underwriting of this project, but it's coming along good. And, you know, next time you see this project in this, in, you know, this house, it'll look very nice. Thanks. Hard Money Bankers.